Please stand for a moment of silence followed by the pledge. And now the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back, Wildcats, to this October 14th edition of the Daily Growl. I'm your very own, Lucas Allen Cox. And I'm Chris. Today is Learn About Columbus Day. Columbus Day is observed in the United States, parts of Canada, Puerto Rico, and even parts of Italy and Spain. It commemorates the landing of Columbus to the New World, aka America. According to History.com, the day is supposed to celebrate his discoveries and his Italian-Spanish heritage. And now, for the history. On this day, 1879, Thomas Alva Edison filed his first patent application for improvement in electric lights on October 14th of 1878. The first successful test was on October 22nd of 1879 and lasted 13 and a half hours. Thank you, Mr. Edison. Now we have LED that can last 40 years. Today we decide we'll play a little game. We'll show a riddle as a class. We'd like to see if you can guess it correctly. Today's riddle is, the more you take, the more you leave behind. What am I? As a class, if you come up with the answer, have your teacher email Mr. Hype with your best guess and we'll reveal the answer in the winning classes tomorrow. You have only until the end of third period to submit an answer. Good luck. Speaking of luck, here's meteorologist Lucas Cox with weather. Today it's going to be partly cloudy skies with a high of 87 and a low of 66 with a 10% chance of rain. A little rain expected on Wednesday, but overall a beautiful week. Right, Chris? Yes. We would like to wish a happy birthday today to Joey Farmer, Aubrey Fuller, Caitlin Lee, Paris Parker, Alexa Rollison, Savannah Moody, Alyssa Taylor, Abigail T, who all had a birthday this past weekend. But today it's all about Jared Cranford. We hope you all have and, and had a happy birthday. Teachers, administration has asked that we remind you to check for dress code at this time. And students, do not forget that you cannot have more than nine unexcused absences until we get back in January. More than nine will earn you credit withheld, unfortunately, in those classes. So be here and do your job. Attendance matters. All students interested in trying out for soccer need to see Coach Finley today. October 14th for a quick meeting about tryouts. This meeting should not take more than a few minutes. Students that are interested in trying out must have a completed physical and athletic participation packet turned into prior tryouts on October 21st. Those who do not have a completed athletic participation packet and physical on fire will not be allowed to try out. If you have any questions, please contact Coach Finley prior to tryouts on October 21st. In other news, the PERT test will be given on Tuesday, October 22nd for students wanting to take dual enrollment in January who need test scores. Students, you must have a 3.0 GPA and you must sign up by guidance by Friday. Save the date. The Baker Prevention Coalition is again hosting a fall ball for high school students in Baker County. The fall ball is scheduled for Saturday, November 9th. You may purchase tickets for $5 during lunches, October 29th through 31st, and again, November 5th through 7th. Tickets will also be available at the door for $10. See Ms. Jackson for details. The Environmental Club would like to invite you to its first meeting on Wednesday after school in Miss Knight's room, 1527. If you're interested in joining this club, please come out and check it out to get information. If you receive an invitation to Beta Club and want to join, please return the signed form and your dues to Miss Smith or place them under her door in room 1201 by Monday, October 21st. Upperclassmen who would like to be invited to join Beta Club must see Miss Smith by Thursday, October 17th. Yearbooks and senior ads are still on sale now at yearbookordercenter.com for just $80, 90 if you want your name on it. See Mr. Finley in room 712 during fifth period to pay by check. Checks only will be accepted at the school 
Act now before the price of this year's yearbook goes up. Seniors who purchased class 2020 t-shirt, please stop by Mrs. Real Room to pick up them ASAP. Freshmen, please go to class of 2023 and vote on a t-shirt design. Voting will be open until tomorrow at noon. I wish I had my fat head right now, but in the meantime, show some love for your favorite athlete or performer by ordering a custom fat head of them to use up in the stands. These are perfect for any sports game, little league, middle slash high school or college competition or graduation ceremony. It will be a two times two plastic cutout on a stick. The price is one for $20 or two for $35. The proceeds benefit BCHS Youth Power. It's the middle of October and fall seasons are wrapping up today, marks the end of the first nine weeks. Tomorrow is NU Alpha Introduction Ceremony. Wednesday is the PSAT, Thursday Cross Country heads to Ralph Simmons, and Friday is the planning day. You get the day off. And it's Seniors Night at Memorial Stadium versus West Nassau. That's the home game of the season. It's going to be a fun week. I know, right? Uh, today for lunch, the feature dish will be banging chicky bites with dinner roll. Tony's pepperoni pizza slice, macaroni slash ham salad, or say cheese burger. That's it for today. We hope you have a marvelous Monday, cats. We'll see you tomorrow. God bless us, everyone. Be kind to one another.